Good morning, fifth grade. This is the test that we are taking today. I will read the questions to you. So listen carefully. I will read them twice. You can always pause if you need to pause or rewind the video if you need to watch them again. All right, guys, show your work and do your best. Here is question number one. Sanya buys a pack of pencils and a pencil sharpener for $8. The pencil sharpener costs three times as much as the pack of pencils. How much does the pack of pencils cost? Sanya buys a pack of pencils and a pencil sharpener for $8. The pencil sharpener costs three times as much as the pack of pencils. How much does the pack of pencils cost? Question number two. A librarian places nine books from his cart on a library bookshelf. Then he had 18 books left on the cart. How many books did the librarian have on the cart before he shelved any books? Question number two. A librarian places nine books from his cart on the library bookshelf. He then had 18 books left on the cart. How many books did the librarian have on the cart before he shelved any books? Here's number 14. What is the value of W in the equation? 6w plus 5 equals 41. What is the value of w in the equation? 6w plus 5 equals 41. Question number 15. Which is a composite number? Which is a composite number? All right, and over here at number five, what is the value of M in the equation? Two plus two times four equals nine plus M. What is the value of M in the equation? Two plus two times four equals nine plus M. Remember to get M alone on one side and balance the equation. Solve for M. All right, number six. A garden has three rows of tomato plants. Each row has 13 plants. Which equation can be used to solve for T, the total number of tomato plants? Number six. A garden has three rows of tomato plants. Each row has 13 plants. Which equation can be used to solve for T, the total number of tomato plants? Question number 15. What is the value of the expression 20 times 4 plus plus? 8 times 6 times 2. What is the value of the expression? All right, we're going to go to the back side of the page. Number 8. What value of R makes the equation true? What value of R makes the equation true? So you have to balance the equation or solve for R. Um, we're going down on the page this time. Number 15, Cleo's bicycle weighs 19 pounds. When she puts her backpack in the bike basket, the total weight of the bike is 27 pounds. Which equation can be used to find B, the weight of the backpack? Cleo's bike, bicycle weighs 19 pounds. When she puts her backpack in the bike basket, the total weight of the bike is 27 pounds. 
which equation can be used to find B, the weight of the backpack? Okay, again, going down on the page, number 18. Elsa's sister earns $126 for six hours of work. The equation 6H equals 126 can be used to find H, the amount she earns in one hour. How much does Elsa's sister earn in one hour? Elsa's sister earns $126 for six hours of work. The equation 6H equals 126 can be used to find H, the amount she earns in one hour. How much does Elsa's sister earn in one hour? Number four at the bottom of the page. A group of 72 students is divided into nine equal groups for a field trip. There must be one adult chaperone for every four students. How many chaperones are needed for each group? How many chaperones are needed for each group? So, I'll read it again. A group of 72 students is divided into nine equal groups for a field trip. There must be one adult chaperone for every four students. How many chaperones are needed for each group? How many chaperones are needed for each group? All right, back up at the top of the page, number 13. Pael needs to simplify six times 12 minus six plus seven. What should be her first step? Pael needs to simplify six times uh, 12 minus six plus seven. What should be her first step? Question number three. Devin simplified a numerical expression. The correct answer is six. Which could be the expression? So they're basically saying the answer is six. Which one of those expressions below equals six? Devin simplified a numerical expression. The correct answer is six. Which could be the expression? Matt had $20. Then he worked seven hours for eight hours each, eight dollars each hour. Which expression matches the words? So Matt had twenty dollars. Then he worked seven hours for eight dollars each hour. Which expression matches the words? And the last question, number twenty. There are six steps leading up. To the museum, each step is eight inches high. Which equation can be used to find the total height of the steps? There are six steps leading up to the museum. Each step is eight inches high. Which equation can be used to find the total height of the steps? All right, guys, show all your work. Go back uh, and review any of these that you need to review. And good luck, and I hope you do well on the test. Bye.